Well, we're soaring high through all of Tampa Bay right now, taking you on a new adventure and a new look that you've never seen before here in town. I'm here with Dave this morning. He's the owner here at Big Red Balloons, and we are literally in the basket of a hot air balloon as we're soaring above the area. Can you explain where we are right now? We're about 380 feet above the new Tampa area flying towards uh, Lando Lakes. And what's your favorite part about flying hot air balloons? Uh, the perspective, I think. Uh, it's an incredible perspective that you just can't get flying in an airplane or a helicopter. It's perfectly quiet. It's peaceful and serene. It's an incredible experience. I and mean, we're having just an absolutely gorgeous morning. We got so lucky with the yeah, weather. We sure did. But what are some of the things that people should know about hot air balloons? Um, well, um, hot air ballooning is one of the oldest forms of flight which I think is really interesting. People don't understand. In fact, there's a little story that we go through at the end of the flight that will, during our champagne toast, that we'll talk about that. Um, but really, hot air ballooning is just an, it's an incredible sport. It really is. You gotta keep heat in it, too. So can you explain that for us? I will. So hot air is, is lighter than cold air. So in order to stay in the air, you got to keep the, the temperature inside the balloon high enough that it gives you the lift. It's the temperature differential between the temperature inside the balloon and the temperature outside the balloon that gives you your lift. Well, it's just a beautiful morning out here. We're having so much fun flying away over Tampa Bay. I'll send it back to you for now.